Welcome back, everybody. And today we're here in my redstone testing world at this machine again. So let's go ahead and clear out last episode that we used this anyway. Press the button and look at what we have to build today. So today we're building a cocoa bean farm using slime block mechanics. So I'm going to go ahead and find a spot here. Let's just go over here. And I think I have a idea in mind. Grab our jungle wood. Bean. There we go. Slime block. Dispensers. Actually, I have that saved in NBT. As well as a piston. Let's see here. There it is. So we're going to go ahead and place a piston down here. And then two slime blocks like this. Two logs. Like that. Go ahead and place our cocoa beans here. And then use my hotkey for NBT items. There's one, two, and we'll have to get up there as well. Three. One, two, and three. Now what we have to do is make a torch burnout clock. And we'll just do it like this. And that'll run forever. Okay, I actually made a mistake here in the design that is very unnecessary and as you can see I'm doing this in post since I have the uh, beautification for the thumbnail here but now that we have the uh, redstone line going up on top of the dispensers there all we need now is a block here and a block going down and then to streamline the design we put two jungle logs right there. The piston would go there. Break that block there. Two slime blocks and two pieces of redstone. And one lever to toggle it. And now it works. As you can see But anyway, that's going to do for today's episode, so like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!